I think probably one of the things that some of us have to realize is that we just have to deal with things in life that are very, very hard. And I know of a young girl up there right now in New York City or maybe down there in Brooklyn who is dealing with a lot of hard times right now. The only thing I've got to say is that even I've gone through times where I felt like that uh, people have no use for me or maybe I'm just not good enough for anyone. Right now this girlfriend of mine up there in New York it, she just feels like that at this point in time that she's no use to anyone. People don't care about her. Well I'm here to tell everyone and tell her if she's watching that someone does care about you and then it's me. And I think ever since me and this girl met somewhere along the way I think she needs to understand that I know it's been hard. Now, from what I understand, I may not know how she feels. I may not know any of that, but I think I can feel her pain. You see, what she doesn't know is that she's special. She's special to me. If it were up to me, I'd have brought her out of that terrible place where she's been for the last eight years and probably just brought her back home with me. Right now I'm a college student attending ITT Tech and maybe I'm not able to do much of the things that any of us would dream of doing. Now I have no doubt that I want to go up there and see her so much or at least spend time with her. I know I would. The thing to do in a situation like this is at least realize that sometimes there are people that care or that sometimes people just don't want to feel like sharing that love and care right now. We're talking about a girl who's been in foster care all her life and probably ended up in several bad situations along the way. Now I'm pretty sure that she wants to come down and spend time with me too. But one of the hardest things to understand is that right now life has become so complicated even for some of the best people. You know I've been at this for a long time. And if it were up to me, I'd have spent my entire pay just to go up there and see her. Which is probably all the more reason for me to start looking for a job the second I graduate. As much as I would want to have as many people as I can watch this or at least understand what I want to do. Now I know that I want to get up there and see her so much, or see her so bad up there in New York. But people, I have to do it myself. The only person that can handle this is me. Now to my girlfriend. 
She really does want to see me. She really does want to be with me. That part I can understand. She knows I care for her so much. She knows I love her. But the only thing I got to say is that I'll do everything I can to get up there to see you. No matter what. Somebody does love you, honey. And I mean more than anything in the world. Somebody does care about you, and that's me. JD, honey, there is nothing in this world that's going to keep me from living my dream, and there's nothing in this world that's going to keep me from being with you. And if anybody should ever find themselves in a situation where they want to be with someone they love so much, I'm pretty sure that you too would do everything you can to get up there, see the people you love. It doesn't matter if it's people you want to marry or maybe someone you wanted to see, you know, for the first time ever. Maybe it's long lost friends or maybe your long lost love. I don't know. I'm sure I want to go up there and see this girl more than anything in the world. But in order to do that, I know I must do it myself. I know I do. No matter how long it takes, even if it's by Christmas time or maybe by the new year, maybe sooner, I will do everything I can to make it possible. And once I get that done, maybe I'll take this girl by the hand and just let her come back with me and just let us both enjoy our time together. Now, people. If you were in, a, in any of my situations or if you were in my shoes, I'm pretty sure you would do the same thing.